We're in Tasmania today to actually highlight the issue of employee entitlements. We've got Jeff Lawrence, the Secretary of the ACTU, Ann Urquhart, our State Secretary, and we've got Phil and Jeff, two former workers, uh, ACL Bearings, who uh, were one of the unfortunate 120 workers that have lost their job, uh, and they've lost tens of thousands of dollars of what rightfully was theirs. And uh, we're very pleased that the government has made the announcement to secure all but 100 cents in the dollar when companies collapse. Uh, and uh, Launceston's an appropriate place because ACL Bearings, where we saw 140 workers lose their jobs, the boss rip off $27 million worth of entitlements, uh, and a lot of workers were short tens of thousands of dollars, what was rightfully theirs. And uh, even though the announcement's not necessarily going to fix up what's happened to ACL Bearing workers, it will ensure that in the future, when companies do collapse, that workers' entitlements will all but be guaranteed. And that's something that our union has been campaigning for for almost 20 years and we're very pleased that the government has made this announcement. But we're not there yet. There is one man standing between us and achieving that objective and that is Tony Abbott. Well, AMW members for the next two weeks need to get out. They need to have the conversation with their family, their friends, their neighbours uh, and if they can, you know, offer a hand to get out and be part of this campaign to ensure that workers' entitlements will be uh, secured in the future. They can contact their office and get involved in this campaign because don't take it for granted. Uh, it is, you know, it, there is a strong possibility that Tony Abbott may end up winning the lodge uh, and we just can't stand by and allow that to happen. So we need to get out, we need to work hard to ensure that Labor is re-elected and we keep Tony Abbott out of the lodge.